we've had a lot of things planned today that just didn't quite work out. Yeah, I, I messaged you online. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. It's me. Yeah, yeah. Nice. yeah the ox. You have our bike? <laughs> hmm? You have our bike? No, we don't have a bike. Oh, we have to hire it. Hire it? A scooter, motorbike. Scooter, scooter, scooter. Scooter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're, okay. You're, I call just... bike. <laughs> is this the place? Yeah, this okay. is a big shop. This is not what I expected. <laughs> like, like the, the bike's fine. It's got everything <laughs> it needs to have, like everything. Oh, not me! <laughs> not me! <laughs> I'll crash! <laughs> I just sit here! Yes, And Now you go around with the work? Yeah, yeah! Oh my god! I, I make a uh, YouTube! Oh, thank you! Yeah. Before I'm travel, I, I love travel because I, I just myself, yeah. I just go five countries and just bring ah, this small this bag small, yeah but now i have a children yeah i need to bring this, this one, one this one, one, this, one. This, one. <laughs> this one oh my god How i just want to stay at home in that day <laughs> where did you go what country uh nepal oh. and japan and before i didn't li live in taiwan i just married in taiwan wow yeah. I'm, we from, i'm from macau Oh, we just, just went, went to Macau. Macau. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah, we did uh, Hong Kong, Macau. We went to Nepal as well. Oh, big head. I have, I have big head. You can choose all it. my brains. No, it's so small. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Shishi. Bye. <laughs> Good smile. Get on my legs off. I feel lower. <laughs> it's, a, it's, a, it's an onigiri pocket. <laughs> Quick access to the onigiri while we drive. Just based off the fact they probably made these and the small children can eat them. The only problem is that <laughs> it's it's milk before cereal, which is wrong. We know it's, it's so always wrong. cereal before oh. milk. But Comment below, do you put your cereal in first and then your milk or your milk and then your cereal? Because if you're putting in your milk before your cereal, you are wrong. Yeah, <laughs> milk before cereal, unsubscribe. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not joking, I'm kidding. <laughs> oh, that's nice. You you do, you do. She did it. Yeah, yeah. Oh. 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 Bye bye. Oh. 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 Let's get moving. Wowman Zauber. Wowman Zauber. Wow, we literally just started and it's already so beautiful here. So I know there are so many like famous tourist sites and things like that here and honestly today we just want to kind of maybe not avoid them but not focus on them as much. We kind of want to see as much of this beautiful place um, kind of at our own pace as we can. We're not hikers. I broke my back about five years ago so that almost kind of prevents me from any long-term walking or elevation unfortunately. So uh, we'll see what we get to do today. <laughs> Didn't get it on camera, but we just crushed the drone, so it might be broken. Is it working? Yeah. 
This, feel all these three. Feel how loose that is when you turn that. I can see what he's doing over there. <laughs> nice face. <laughs> Stop it. It's we couldn't we couldn't fix it anyway. It's broken beyond like we have to get someone to actually replace this part. Just a lot of money. You know? Well, no more drone shots for at least two months from anybody. I was going to buy a new one now. Oh, oh, no, I'm, not, oh. Yeah. I'm having the honor, Gary. <laughs> kimchi pork. And I've Might got. Be a bit spicy for you, kimchi pork. Okay, you have that one then. I've got grilled pork with salted uh, onion. This is so cool. Look at this. You pull these out the side. Oh my goodness. And then it comes like wrapped in the seaweed already. Put this in the bin. Hold on. Not bad. Not as good as the one I had in Hong Kong. I'll say that much. You know what? At least we're in one of the most beautiful places in the world to suit the problem, right? This day couldn't get any worse. <laughs> wow! Did you just fix that? It's still broken though. Yeah, okay. It's dodgy. Just thought I'd quickly run over this side and show you, like, look how beautiful this part of the world is. This is insane. You've got running water down here. Oh my goodness. Oh, this is absolutely stunning. But honestly, if you ask me, I do think it's about to get a whole lot better. We just have to hope we don't get here. It's like a lottery, basically. So we have not gotten very far and already there is bright blue water. This is, this place is insane. I can't believe it. I literally can't believe it. Look at this water. It is crystal blue clear. It is absolutely crazy. You see that there's rock slide things on the side so obviously they get heaps of rock slides there's workers on the side here all the way up and they're basically their job is to pick up the rocks it can be really really dangerous obviously as you can imagine but look at this i can't i can't get over it i can't get over this place i did not expect this i didn't expect how the the beauty of taiwan or or taruka gorge or or anything and i'm i'm just so glad that i came here i'm so glad that i decided to come <laughs> oh my god, okay. We're probably gonna we stop by here where we were before and we're just probably gonna go so, somewhere and tell you about it, but <laughs> Michael was flying a drone and then he hit a tree and then it just got stuck and it's somewhere up there. The beast is freaking following me. I want to get hit by a bee. Calm down a little bit, but basically it's up, up in here somewhere. And this bee keeps following me. I'm probably gonna get stung, and I've never been stung by a bee before, so I'm probably gonna die. <laughs> it's my fault, by the way. I'm sorry for headbutting you with my helmet just then. It's my fault. Josie told me to stop. I was getting what I thought was a really good shot. The funny thing is we're connected to the drone right now and I can just see its final resting place. I can see it. It's just, we're still connected to it. It's staring at that beautiful view up there, which is actually pretty, for all the things that that drone's been through, it's quite a nice spot for it to, I mean, it tried to, it tried to finish itself today and then I fixed it and maybe it was trying to tell us something. 
Maybe was, I was trying to tell you something. It was trying to tell us that I'm an idiot and I should have stopped flying it when it was incapacitated like that. Um, I don't know, it's tough. <laughs> I know, it's like it's like a first world problem, but I'm allowed to be upset about it. Of it's so much money. Upset. Yeah, it's so much money and, <laughs> and like it's a significant setback as nice and happy as you try and be on camera. It's a significant setback to lose something that costs that much money because you got it. Did it, are you sure you got I got a screen recording because the um the it's not it's taking too long to download the files. It's just too far away to download fast enough so it's downloading too slow. We can't look here it is radar it's fallen down a little bit but i don't know where i have no idea of finding where <laughs> Really high? <laughs> Is it too high? You guys, that's a. I can. Uh. Just there? I'll climb up. I'll, I can boost you up. I'll climb. Alright, you put that down. I'll boost you up. Is it still making the noise? I can't hear the noise, no. Can you see how far it is on the... It's like here somewhere. I oh, can't see exactly where that. Okay. Can you come here? We've had the worst f***ing <laughs> day of I just dropped my helmet down there as well. All right, you ready? <laughs> you have to put your foot in the spot. Yep. And then, ready? Go. I'll put on me. Hold on. So this foot nice. <laughs> Can you get there? <sighs> Oh, no. Ow! <laughs> no. <laughs> Alright, I tried to go up. I got I saw so many spiders I tried to go up in here and there. And now something's either bit me or I've got stung by a nettle or something. It's in my butt as well. It's stinging so hard. And the amount of spiders I saw there, well, I mean that's two. I'm gonna be honest with you. Um <laughs> but I'm scared to go even further in, but I don't know, if I knew it was right there I'd I'd go, but I just don't I don't know where it is. Is it definitely out of battery? Yeah, the trying to be out of battery right now. All right. We're not going to be able to get it. Let's go, let's go see a couple more places. You wear the helmet, I won't. And then we'll go back to, we'll go back to town, yeah? Okay. Yes, yeah, thank you, yes, yeah. Thank you. Yes, yeah, thank you so much. All right, well, bye drone. Up there somewhere, I guess. Hope you're comfortable. Uh, we're gonna go somewhere and sit for a second because, yeah. yeah. Play Charlie Puth. What's the. It's been a laugh. I'm trying to make a laugh. Manny, you don't want to laugh at you. <laughs> somewhere where we can just kind of sit because I'm just it's just a lot for me right now but um that was one back there it was, it was too full so we're trying to head up to the next one but there's people everywhere there's like one lane right now of cars <laughs> oh my leg my leg is stinging I'm scared I'm scared I'm scared this line Huh? This, this is probably one of the most special things I've I've seen in my life and as frustrating as the last couple of hours have been when you look at this we're in between two massive massive mountains and this is where the Truku people who lived here the Aboriginal people this is this was their life they they swim down these rivers they probably could have got your helmet if they were around 
I'm too scared near the corner the edge like this. All right, you ready to go? Yeah. We have to share one lane here, so it's a bit tough. <laughs> it's right there. Okay, <laughs> okay we're, we're fine. <laughs> After everything that happened today, I don't want to be near the edge. Okay. And now we're good, yeah? Look, two lanes. <laughs> So Michael's gone back to move the bike because this morning she told us don't park if there's a red line, only park if there's a white line and there's a red line back there. And even though there's other people parked there, I just honestly, if anything could happen today, if anything else could go wrong, it's gonna go wrong. So I just told him to move the bike. I'm gonna walk to this little town thing over here. Uh, I can't not stop and look at this. This is, this is absolutely insane, but honestly, I'm scared to be near the edge after today. I don't know what else there is to possibly go wrong, but I'm probably gonna drop my phone in a river by the end of the day. And seeing as though earlier on, I said what else could go wrong and everything else did, I'm gonna touch some wood and hope I don't drop my phone in a river. So I, I am not a, the show must go on kind of girl and just put the camera back on and be happy for the rest of the video. Honestly, I feel like I need to just sit down here for a second. I need to regroup, I need to, just take a second before I can continue on filming or the video or even honestly just with the day. I'm just not someone who can be like, all right, let's turn on a smile. I don't feel like smiling right now. The best bet's gonna be probably the Starbucks it has their own coffee shop in there. Starbucks? I mean, sorry, I meant 7-Eleven. You really just want to make this day worse, don't you? Yeah, that's bad then. That's the worst thing that's happened here today. <laughs> oh, sorry. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. <laughs> All right, bye. You're so cute. <laughs> Change your tail. <laughs> All right. Yeah, almost. If I got bit by a fucking dog today, I swear to God. Haven't crashed a drone in two years. Haven't got bit by a dog in two years. Haven't dropped a helmet off a cliff in Have two years. Have mistaken Starbucks to 7-Eleven a few times though. So you got 7-Eleven coffee. That's pretty much your best bet. All right. There is monkeys. And even on the no, best no, of days, no, 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 I am no. not trying to go near monkeys. Yeah, but you can't catch it twice. <gasps> Herpes. Today would be the day I get herpes. I'm not, I'm not going near them. I'm not going near them. All right, let's get some coffee. Do you want anything else? Uh, a bing natier. All right, Michael said he's where the herpes filled monkeys are. So hopefully, oh wow, it's pretty. It smells like literal feces. Yeah, I only just got out of just then. I didn't oh. get that okay, I'm not going near the toilet. It, it smelled, it's not, oh, that's the it smells so started. bad. I smelled it when you got here. Can we have uh, one, please? One donut? Yes, please. You need a sugar? Oh, yeah. How much? 40p. Yeah, that'll do. 40 40 40 40 40 Thank you. Uh, Michael. Thank you so much. A lot of bird poop on this. I know it's been pretty negative, but Can't say I chose negative. this shot on purpose. Look at this background. So you might be wondering why we mentioned that we were just never supposed to come here and put aside all the events that just transpired. <laughs> um, I have a history with this place. I just have a strong gut feeling today all day and right now that today just isn't I just today just isn't the day I thought I normally have a little bit of anxiety when I rent a bike or a car for the first time in a new country because there's new road rules there's new like this that that I have to figure out I just thought that my like pit of despair in my stomach today was me being stressed about having to drive around in a new country again after having that one in my last video, it's just it's not the same. It's is it? not the same. So Michael has had what? You got sugar on your mouth. Michael's had. Is this your third time trying to come here? This is my third attempt and first successful. Well, first successful attempt at getting here. It hasn't been a successful day. Yeah, so the first time I tried to come here, I was really young. I just started my online business. I thought I was ready to travel 
the world and, and work at the same time, which is the whole reason I started the business. Got to Kuala Lumpur, about, which is my first stop, and about two weeks in, had a mental breakdown and I had to come home. So I, I missed out, I had all, this, all, I had all this booked. I was gonna hike some trail when I was about 10 years younger and 50 kilos lighter. You know, once I figured everything out, I started traveling and it was easy. life was easier. I traveled all the time and I thought, I'm gonna go back to Taiwan and I'm gonna, I'm gonna do this. And I got to Taipei um, and I was 24 hours away from catching the train here to Hualien to do the Zulu Trail, which um, we could put a picture on the screen of, maybe, maybe not. Um, that's the trail that, that I was gonna do. And I go to sleep in Taiwan and sometime I'm in bed, I feel a little tremor. It turned out to be, what, one of the biggest earthquakes here and it was just devastating for... We finished eating. <laughs> I woke up the next morning, my train was I think at two or three in the afternoon and the images coming out of Hualien. There was a major storm and a um, earthquake at the same time. Buildings had toppled over. People had lost their businesses. You couldn't obviously come into here because an earthquake is gonna cause rock slides and all sorts of things in a place like this. When I was booking this trip with Josie, I thought, when am I supposed to come here? Is something bad gonna happen if I come here? And it did. You know what though? I think like when you're a tourist and you're traveling around, and if you, like I think anyone's gonna get upset if you crash an expensive piece of equipment into a tree. Totally. And you can't get it back and then like you have your rental helmet for the motorbike and it falls off the bike and rolls into a ravine so with michael's not so great luck here um at this point i'm just hoping we get back in one piece so my leg hurts my pride hurts i'm tired from crying but look at this travel 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 you have good days you have bad days just like in life Oh, you have to be so careful. There's perspective, right? Okay, we've had a. Now I'm gonna cry again. We've oh. had a bad day, but we didn't recognize that. That's gonna make me upset. Because I can oh. imagine how he feels. Oh. Now that. Now we've lost a twelve, fifteen hundred dollar drone and he's lost his car. Like. Day. <laughs> hey, <my. laughs> it's come out of the clips. Undo it. You have to undo it. We follow the seasons, the pathways of the We're driving past this this part, this bridge we saw, and I, I said, you know what, if I don't stop, I'm gonna probably re regret it. It's gonna take a little time to myself and walk over this bridge for a second. This is insane. Oh my goodness. I wanted to do something like this in Nepal and I never got to it, but honestly today I feel like it might not be a good day to push my luck, but oh my God, it's moving. <gasps> ah, no. <laughs> Don't do that! <laughs> I'm scared! <laughs> I'm super emotional today, so this probably is just exasperating that, but sometimes I wish you could keep a moment in your brain like you keep a photo, like you can't, so I'm just gonna try and take this in as much as I can. Stay here forever by your side at the edge of the water. So in light of the events that happened today, I'm gonna to ask a massive favor from you guys. I'm gonna ask you to just watch this video a little bit longer than you normally would, or put it on in the background, go do something else, uh, and help me pay for a new drone. <laughs> so after we drove back, we actually stopped in a small little town, a little village, um, to see this man. We stopped in a Truku village, and Truku is the local Aboriginal people and all the stuff I'd seen online just says you can drop into his studio and see him but when we got there it wasn't it wasn't it didn't feel like that did it it felt like someone's backyard and it felt like he was probably you know sitting on the couch 
listening to music or doing something or working on some art or whatever and then we just rock up into his backyard and say hey entertain us it didn't feel right i didn't want to use anyone for content or anything like that without their, with, permission, yeah. without their permission or or anything so that didn't work out which is is totally fine um so i mean we've had a lot of things planned today that just didn't quite work out and you know what that's the reality of travel things get broken lost uh misplaced whatever the case may be so i feel like now that the video didn't go to plan, I'm winging this video at this point. <laughs> Here I am in the next country. Uh, the drone was left in Taiwan and we couldn't get it back. But in hindsight, we're safe, we're alive. I just have to buy a new $2,000 drone. <laughs> but if we're having a transparent conversation, last month was my most successful month financially on my channel. So I just wanted to say, Thank you so much for making that happen. It doesn't help that a large chunk of that now has to go towards buying a new drone. <laughs> but I just wanted to share that milestone that I've had on my channel with you. This is more of a personal vlog than usual. And I think I'm going to start doing more of them. For me, something that's really important to me is being real and honest. And this is real and honest. I know quite a few people who would never post publish on this video because they just couldn't stand to see people see them cry and that's not me. You're gonna have good days and you're gonna have bad days whether you travel or not but the important thing to realize is you're not alone in having them. <laughs>